He tell me I'm special. Tell me get it together. Or tell him to get it. Don't tell me to get it together. But... <laughs> You see how I just brush my teeth? Very classy, very considerate. You see how I just scrub the gunk off my tongue? What's up, y'all? We back again with another mother freaking panger, like mother freaking always. Did you miss me? Because I missed y'all. I was not present last week. Let me bring you over here. I was editing this one video and it just like, Matrix, when I'm talking, you don't talk. If you don't know who Matrix is and you're new to this channel, it's my cat. She's been here for a decade now. Why do I look like I could be a rock star? Let me slow down because if you are new to this channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and feel the vibe and see who the fuck I am because I'm such a boy. I tried to record last week and the video that I was trying to record, y'all know if it don't give or it's just messing up, I'm not going to show y'all that. So it crashed last week, but we're back again. Lord, thank God in the name of Jesus. I love all y'all who support me and love me dearly because I do this for y'all. You feel me? I hope this last week y'all did good. Y'all stayed out the way. Y'all stayed focused on y'all mission. Y'all kept God first. And if you didn't do that last week, make sure this week that I pray God gives you, you keep your head on the pedestal. It's F everybody that try to go against you. You stay focused on the mission the opposition and stay on the mission and go ahead and get it period don't play with me so this title is gonna be like life after high school because if you don't know i just graduated in june you feel me so everything is new like everybody about to start going to school and then there's me hey but i am going to college i don't know if i told y'all that but surprise i'm going to college i start september 23rd it's still like um new to me because it this type of school it's very on you like nobody's telling you to get up go to school you don't hear your mom yelling wake up i told you wake up no it's really just me on me i'm not mad at it it's just like you know more of a responsibility and it's just also a reminder to get your together and have a routine and have structure so you can stay focused you feel me when you get out of high school your habits Oh my gosh, they're so crucial. Like your habits are already crucial before even high school starts or whatever. But after high school, your routine is so freaking crucial, y'all. I keep looking at myself in this camera. I know I look crazy, y'all. I don't give a damn. But like I was saying, y'all, it's so crucial. You feel me? Like you laying in bed all day playing the Xbox or gonna go or or every single second is gonna play a part. You feel me? How your life is going to turn out. Your habits. Your habits create your future. You feel me? So, all I'm trying to do in this season of me growing into my adult self is better myself, better my habits, strengthen my relationship with God, better myself mentally, physically, and spiritually, and emotionally, be in tune with y'all, stay focused on school, and then I got another hobby I'm going to talk about, but we, you know, just stay focused on myself. And as I'm recording and posting all this content, I want y'all, I want to be honest with y'all. I want to um, hear what y'all going through after high school or in high school so we can be like a growing channel. Like, I'm growing with y'all, you growing with me. So it's a give and give. Like, I'm on FaceTime with my sisters right now. Like, girl, what you doing? How you doing? How you being here? Yeah. Let me give y'all the rundown what's about to go down. I know my hair looks crazy, so please don't look at this art and be like, girl, who the fuck do you be? What type of idea do you even have? I'm going to pursue my hair talents. I'm really good at hair. I never put myself out there because it's just like, I don't like competition because I'm not the type of competition person. I'd rather sit back and just let you have it. And I know it's also a tough game out there. And a lot of girls in this that industry is very like, Ugh, you feel me? And I'm such a type of person that's just like, I like to do my own thing, vibe. That's why I do YouTube and do brand promotions because, you know, I'm not in competition with nobody. But then I, I had a realization. <laughs> and I 
hope this motivates y'all too. Whatever you want to do. One day I did somebody's hair because I do have loyal clients that's like low key. But one time I did somebody's hair and I don't post this. So, but one time I did somebody's hair and I'm like, bro, I'm really good at this. Like I can make some money on. And also too, like, yes, you know what I'm saying, Lord, thank. you. I'm so blessed. I do get paid from YouTube and I do get paid, you know what I'm saying, doing promotions or other side hustles. But also too, I'm getting to an age where it's like, okay, I have to really start providing for myself, you know what I'm saying, more money. Of course, things take time to grow. Like, of course, I want to make more money on YouTube. I want to make more money doing promote. I want to make more. I want to do more. I am more. But it's all a, it's all a time thing. So. I would try to get nine to fives to, you know what I'm saying, add that to my money bank. But nine to fives just don't work out for me. Like, I don't know what it is, y'all. I run through nine to fives like a pair of pennies. Like, in one year, I probably have three jobs. Two. Two or three. I worked at Forever 21. I worked at Ulta. I worked at Chipotle. I worked at this skincare thing at the mall. I worked at Crumble Cookie. Like, I... Y'all... Work with me, okay? So I'm at this point where it's like, okay, um, I need to figure it the fuck out because there's so much stuff I need, so much stuff I want. So it's just like we need to make a plan. You feel me? Like I'm not finna be I, I can't be broke. That's just something I can't do. I don't like it. Um, I don't like it to my pockets and it's empty. So I'm gonna hustle by any means. I'm gonna at least have five hustles. Anyway. And I just want that to motivate y'all because just like get off ass and go triple your bag I've decided to triple my bag with my own talents I've been getting paid for my own talents and I'm not going to stop it now So I'm going to keep working towards what's my calling Obviously God gave me this talent for a reason So I'm not going to have this talent and be like oh there's competition Or when you go to the grocery store and you need some bread and you go to the bread aisle You know how many bread brands you see? You got the big, you got the loaves, you got the seeded breads, you got the raisin bread. You got so much different brand quality of breads. So when you hop in a game, content industry or hair industry or food industry, don't put in your mind, oh, they doing this, I don't want to copy them or I don't know how to do what you do, but make it your own. See, a lot of people will hop on away because it's trending and not really have a spark behind that content. Or not have a spark behind their business because they're doing stuff off of it, it's trending or it looks fun, it looks cute. I, everything I do because it's passion behind it. I don't want to talk y'all ear off because I know I can get to talking. So let me to give y'all a run that I was about to go down. I'm going to do my hair. I don't know when I was about to do it right now. But I got ADHD and I got to move around. So I'm going to do something else. I'm going to probably fix my hair up so I don't look as crazy on camera. But y'all know I never get it ever so because y'all know when it's time to lay a wig i do exactly that <laughs> yeah don't play with me play with your mama i don't care y'all y'all know what it is y'all know what i'm like i'll do my hair later let's go all right y'all so if you don't know where i'm at oh i did not show matrix but she is getting big y'all if y'all remember the last time y'all seen her i'm in the living room so like I said, I am actually going to pursue the hair business. I'm about to take this living room and turn it into like a hair salon because my mom, my me, like my family, we are very like entrepreneurs. So my mom was like, you know, we don't use the living room. We be busy all day. So take the living room, do what you do. Thank you, mom Duke. So that's what I'm gonna do. What I'm gonna do with that mannequin, I really wanna get her dressed it up and put a wig on her so she look good. Cause uh Look what she got on, respectfully. And I want to clean this out. My little sister, Raya, is back in town from Vegas. She'll be here until December. So, her suitcases and stuff, but we finna move that to the back. These garbage bags, I'm finna see what's up. Um, the piano, I don't know where that's going, but it's not in here. What y'all finna see me do is straighten some stuff up, but I'm not gonna put nothing in here because I still have to write some stuff down, what I wanna get, and I have to look up some ideas of what I wanna do. Cause I wanna get like some wallpaper for the wall. We have a calendar right here, so I'm gonna start putting my clients on there. You feel me? Like it's gonna be, <laughs> yeah. Give me about like a month. 
this all finna be turned around. So I'm keep y'all always updated. But y'all finna just see me clean this area. Four o'clock, I have a client coming to drop her wig off for me to pluck and bleach so I can apply it tomorrow morning. You feel me? Yeah, so come on now. Y'all, I'm a busy girl. And y'all, did I eat today? I didn't even eat, y'all. I had I well, I had a late start. Like I need to work on my sleeping schedule because it's not giving. But I'm gonna do better, and you know what I'm saying. We're all gonna do better. You feel me? Like we're great. We're, we gotta remind ourselves that. But I did do my daily affirmations to remind myself who the God am. Thank the Lord. And yeah, y'all. So y'all gonna see me clean this up? I'm gonna play some music. So y'all, I'm not gonna talk to y'all because I need to be in my zone. Y'all already know how I am when I'm in that zone. You feel me? Type the bus and keep on heading to the day come. You hold on. I don't need your love. I'm too busy making bank runs. He told me he loved me because I told him I ain't staying long. Uh, uh. Yes, sir. Cut him off quick. I gotta sit and observe. Blowing up my phone had to block a bid. Indeed. 40 inch bundles down to my motherfucking knee. See, I don't have 40 inch bundles right now, but this, when I made that song, I had 40 inch. Hold on. 40 inch bundles down to my motherfucking feet. Run my ass up like a fresh pack of socks. Yeah, and I'm gonna create like a wall for them so like I can take pictures with the wall and then have a mirror. And then I'm gonna decorate her so I'm gonna give her like a real wig. Family matter and the truth for the plants and I told the body show y'all the liar. Alright you guys, so I just got done cleaning with all my hair supplies. So I'm putting them in this little bucket of hair supplies. So everything in here is clean and sanitized. Don't play with me, play with Shamata. And then all of this is just like bleach and stuff, brushes, gels, wig caps, um, hair clips, developer. And stuff like that. What's up you guys? So I know I still look crazy. Y'all probably like, your hair still ain't done? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. <laughs> no, motherfucking ma'am, y'all. When you be on the go and busy all the time, the last thing you got time for is hair. Like, I don't even know if I have time to do my hair tonight. I know I'm going to make time because that's just what I do. That's just how I am. As I'm cleaning up, I want to talk even. Life after high school, though, like, it hasn't, like, fully kicked in for me to be, like, you know, this is a real deal because, like I said, I'm not a fully year in of graduation, so it's like it's still fresh. But I can, I got it just up like, okay, you know what I'm saying? This is it. <laughs> but I'm really excited for what God has planned for me, you know what I mean? Like, there are times I ain't gonna lie, my human self, I just be having my times where I'm just like, well. Is this it? Like, God, what you have planned for me? Like, I'm stressing, like, God, I just want to do stuff, I just want. To have a good life i don't want to be a bum i don't want to be working a nine to five forever like god just please i don't know what you're gonna do with me just just do something right but then i also have to snap into reality like you can ask god for so much but it's just like if you're not doing nothing to at least align yourself in a certain degree like god can only do so i'm not saying you know what i'm saying god's not capable because god can do wonders if he if he wanted to just drop a million dollars in my cash app he could do that but you know what i mean he's he want to see me put some work in so that's what i'm doing and i just pray and i know it's gonna pay off it's just 
the time wise and the um, patience that I lack like I like patience and I've been praying for more patience time is of the essence and God's timing is always the right time and God's never gonna give us something that you know what I'm saying he know we're gonna jeopardize or can't handle you feel me he gonna give us to it to us at the right time so it's just like we probably be thinking it's the right time just do it come on God I got, I got. but it's just like no it's not like there be times where I'll be like I look back and be like dang I'm glad you ain't give me that back then because I would have fumbled it you feel me so if I'm already thinking back, I don't know what's happening now, if that makes any sense. When you're a person that really cares about your life and, um, you know what I'm saying, especially when you have, like, dreams like me, I don't know about y'all, but sometimes it's just those doubtful thoughts that just be coming in my mind and kind of putting me down, like, what if this don't happen or what if I end up just like, or, you know what I mean, like, what if all this hope and praying, you know what I mean, just those doubtful thoughts be coming in my mind sometimes and I just gotta remind myself who I am and who I'm up against and who's fighting for me you know what I mean because God's not gonna allow you to fight you know what I mean um and I gotta also remember who's real like the the God within me the source the 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 powerful God Almighty that created my soul, my soul's mission. Like, he's the one I'm trusting and holding on for dear life. Because I know he's the only one that's going to get me where I need to be. Not the only one, you know, like I already just said, it's going to take me to. But I'm just saying, like, when you overthink, like, you just got to learn to just do. I get caught up where I'm at. And then I start complaining because I'm not where I want to be. So it's just like that overthinking of where I want to be. And knowing I'm not where I want to be and all of that. And then it's just like God will remind me you walking by sight and not by faith. Because you know the saying to walk by faith and not by sight. I want y'all to know like if you having those thoughts too. I understand it's normal. Especially like when you want so much. And then like you see other young people or older people doing certain things. And you like dang like I feel behind. Like you feel me like. I don't think like that. You're exactly where you need to be. You feel me? So, yeah, I thought I just put that in there. Did you subscribe yet? Oh, you tripping? Make sure you press that, baby. Because what are you doing? Watching me this far and not subscribe to your girl. I really look crazy on camera, y'all. This is not okay. It looks like really different from when y'all first seen it. Like y'all seen all them bags over there? No bags. These, these bags is full with the um, grass wall bags that I was going to put up on one of these walls. But I don't know if I want to do it yet. But it's right there. So that's full with the grass wall. We got the mannequin, the light. So yeah, it's all cleaned up better than when we first seen it. So just a quick little update. This is unacceptable. This is, I don't allow this type of, you feel feng shui. Maybe we can try again tomorrow. But it's alright. People that know promise know I know how to lay a motherfucking wing. I ain't got to prove myself to a motherfucking thing. Don't have to. Grand Rising. What's up, guys? It is the next day. It is August 26th. Ain't in the motherfucking morning. I woke up. Let me push y'all back. I woke up a little late today. I was supposed to wake up at five. I woke like around six something. I fell asleep late. The power behind how you end your night is going to play a big part on how you enter your new day. It's so big. Because y'all, you never want to end your night kind of because then you're going to wake up feeling like, ah, you feel me? So it's like, I gotta work on that, but I know I'm gonna have a good night routine tonight, Lord willing. I might record another separate video like a night routine, you feel me? Show y'all what I do. But yeah, um, she comes at 9.30, my hair client, I already set it up. I just don't feel like recording and doing all that because um, I was trying to hurry up and recording does take time and I'm on borrow time because I woke up a little late. Shame on me, shame on me. But yeah, if you woke up today, make sure you thank the Lord, say your affirmations, remind yourself who the fuck you is. Um, and like this new day, be a reminder that you got another shot at life. So give it all you can give. You feel me? But I'm about to put some clothes on, lotion up, and brush my teeth, wash my face and skincare, and then I'm gonna hit y'all. I have a bodysuit on, you guys, all black, fully covered. 
And then I'm gonna throw this cute little knit sweater on top of it to keep it cute and casual, you feel me? People be like, what do you use for your skincare? I, after I get done washing my face, I apply vitamin C like the pills and I pop it on my face. And if you have oily skin, I don't know if this can work for you. If anything, it probably will break you out. But I have dry prone skin, so if anything, this adds moisture to my face plus a glow. So this benefits for me. Or it might work. I don't know. Everybody's skin is different. Like, people be like, oh, you're not supposed to do this. You're not supposed to do this. Um, but this works though. <laughs> this works though. After I get done with my skincare, I'm gonna do my hair, set up the salon, you feel me? <laughs> I just finished setting up everything and as I wait you feel me I'm gonna do some gratitude in my journal <laughs> I always start the day off with showing gratitude, just giving thanks for, you know what I'm saying, what's not here yet, you know what I'm saying, because it's already here, you know what I'm saying, giving thanks in advance, because God said only acts one time, and sometimes we take that stuff for granted until it's gone, so, that's what I'm about to do, until she pull up, you feel me, so, y'all probably won't hear from me until after I'm done with her hair.